Welcome everybody to another episode of Kool-Aid Outdoors. I am your host Kool-Aid. We are freezing. It is a little chilly tonight. It is about 3.23 in the evening and we are going to try this new spot here in Rock Creek. Let's see if we can uh, hook into something birdie. Uh, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Hope you enjoyed the episode. All right. Well, off camera, I fished this spot for a few minutes. Actually, like, not even a minute. Realized that it is super shallow, so let's move on to another spot. Let's cook up a little lunch. Chunky's starving. If we can get water froze, unfroze. Disgusting, but I'm gonna use it to thaw my water bottles out. Hopefully, that's the plan. Chicken teriyaki. Let's give that a try. One and two thirds cup. Hope if our water wasn't pro solid. Alright. Calling it good enough. I don't want to know what that is. There is a lot of stuff in here. Pretty gross. I'm going to waste that. Guess we're starting over and getting more water. A little at a time. Just gotta find some more frozen bottles. If I was smarter, I would have poured that in there to add more water to it. Talk about time consuming. All right, we finally got enough water to make coffee. Finally. I don't know if you can see this. Let me see if I can get it to work. This is pretty gross. <laughs> or fog up instead, that works. All righty, well, got the water in the back. Um, sorry I wasn't filming for that. There was some people here and I was talking to them and forgot to hit record. So, <laughs> we're back at it, trying to finish throwing out some water to make some coffee. So, yeah, we'll see what happens. And we'll see if this stuff tastes good. I've had it before and the last time I had it, it was not good. So, let's see if I can make it taste better. Every artillery this time for it, see if we can get it to taste better. By the way, I just want to point it out, it is 33 degrees since the last time I looked. I'm freezing. It is cold. I can't wait for the coffee to get done. I really wish I'd have got water that was thawed out. <laughs> I say next time instead of one of these, I do spam and eggs. Or bologna and eggs. Fr fried bologna and eggs. Or beef stew. I'm not sure. Maybe some beef stew with some add a little extra to it. I'd try something different. Where is it? Finally! Got some coffee! Coffee! So cold! Hopefully I don't burn myself. Oh yeah. Alright. Let's uh add some Folgers Classic Instant Coffee. I have no idea how much to put in here. 
Twenty plus six ounces. So this is twenty. Twelve. Yeah, we'll go with that. Let's see what happens. That looks nasty. <laughs> that looks really bad. Why is it so brown? Oh, the creamer. That's why. Yeah, nope. I think I'm going to have to do French press. Because uh, that stuff is absolutely horrid. Wow, that stuff is bad. Yeah, I don't think I can do it. But I'm cold enough, I gotta drink it, so. I have no choice, because holy cow, it's cold. It's not that cold, but still 30 degrees. And I'm just sitting here, so it's cold sitting here. Did I add too much? Wow, that is so bad. God, that's a lot of creamer. But I don't even know if that's gonna help. I hope I just put too much in again. Well, not again. I hope I put too much in. It's the first time I've made it myself, and so far, not going good. This stuff is absolutely bad, so bad. Still tastes pretty bad, but it burned out, so now I can't taste it. Anywho, now we got coffee. Dinner time. Lunch time. What do you want to call it? It's almost 5 o'clock at night. I waited a little late to eat, but... Not bad. I'm impressed. All right. It's definitely one of the better ones that I've tried so far. That's really not bad at all. I must have did it right too, because everything's done. Alrighty, let's see if we can make it down to the river. This, on camera, does not look very steep. But in person, it's pretty steep. So, let's see what happens. This might have been a bad decision. But let's see if we can make it. I don't know if it's because I love to fish. Yeah, it's because I love to fish. That's why. <laughs> That's the only reason. I'm only making these videos because I love to fish and love the outdoors. And that would be kind of cool to video it and just kind of show people what I do. I just about broke my fish pole. That was close. Oh man, they're cold. Let's make a couple cap. Oh, look at that. Amateur. Amateur. Right in the tree, right in the bush. I'll get back to you. All right, let's try that again. Let's see if I can not do that again. I don't know how long this is gonna last. My fingers are so no, and that was kind of cool. Big old chunk of snow or something just fell off of a tree up there. Oh, look at all that ice. Look at all that ice floating by. Oh, it sounds eerie. Man, that's a big chunk. Wow, oh, there's more coming down. Wow, this is crazy. Ooh. A little excited. A little excited there. I don't know what it was. A little excited though. Okay. Look at that. I don't know if I can see it or not. This is gorgeous. I'm losing daylight, by the way. Huh. 
kind of cool to hook up into one more fish though. But it is getting kind of late, so they're not acting like they're interested. Talked to a couple fellas that were down here earlier, and they have had zero luck in here, so my expectations are not super high, that's for sure. Not high at all. I don't know how long I'm going to make it. My fingers are so cold. Might have to cut this episode a little short, but I'm going to try to catch some. I'm really going to try. As long as I can. <gasps> Got one. I told you I was going to try. <laughs> told you I wasn't going to give up right away. Yes. Look at that. He's tiny, but he counts. He counts. Come on, little feller. Oh, come on. Come on. I'm trying to let you go, buddy. Easy, big fella. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm not going to lie to you, folks. This might be the only fish on this episode. But it is pretty, even though it's small. I mean, look at that thing. Gorgeous. Mm, looking at rocking that HD trout. Mm. Yes. Thanks for playing, buddy. I didn't have high expectations because I've been talking to some fellas that were here and they did not have any luck. So, me catching one, I'm happy. Super happy right now. Just wish I could figure out the, the whole angle of the dangle here because this is horrible, horrible, horrible quality of video right now. I apologize. I will get better. I will get better. That ice is a little dangerous on the fishing line. That is for sure. Ooh, that's a big chunk of ice. Gotta beat it. What size is that thing? That thing is thick. That's a thick old piece of ice. Yeet. By the way, while I'm sitting here, uh, just railing in, freezing. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hopefully I can keep this content coming to you. I really enjoy it. This is fun. Won't be just fishing. There's some four-wheeling. A little bit of everything. Anything outdoors, pretty much. Maybe some pew-pews. So, just wanted to throw that out there while I was waiting. Thanks, everyone, for tuning in for another episode of Kool-Aid Outdoors. Hope everybody enjoyed the episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And we'll see you on the next adventure.